Hello everyone. Um, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to make a world map uh, animated logo. Let me show you the uh, end result. Let's go to preview. Let's clean this. That's what you're going to see. The end result. Okay. Let's get started. Um, just go all the way back. Here I'm going to make a new composition. 700 by 400, 25 frames per second. It's going to be 10 seconds. And how to, uh, we're going to import our file. And there are several ways you can import file. One is just go to file and then say file. Or you can just press Command I on Mac, and if you press Command I, you can import file. Or you can just uh, if you double click on your uh, on your project uh, and uh, here, if you double click here, that's a way to get it. So I'm just gonna double click on my file, which was located on desktop, and I'm gonna drag it to here, and. Uh, Scale it a bit, yeah. and now I'm going to make uh, a solid a solid layer and by command Y and say OK. I'm going to give this um, a gradient. If you just type. Uh, if you just type here on the effect and presets, you say ramp and uh, double click on the ramp, and then that's what you get. And let's change the color of this to kind of blue and change this color to kind of it's up to you what kind of color you like, but do it my way. Uh, Let's make it a bit more. And drag the solid layer under the image. And select the image layer. And go to effects and presets. And type here sphere. And then you get the CC sphere. I'm not sure if you if the CC sphere you have it in After Effects CS3. I'm working in After Effects CS4. So if you don't have it, you can get it from Trap Code, C, Trap Code CC Particles. If you just type in Google Trap Code for After Effects, I'm sure you will, you will get somewhere. And what you do is how to apply the CC sphere. You can apply it several ways. Uh, one way is that you can just uh, you have to select your uh, your layer it have to be selected and then you if you double click on the CC sphere it will apply or you can just drag the CC sphere just like uh, uh, by just dragging it like this on the oh it's already applied but let me just control see that if you just drag this on the on the top of the layer or on the image here, it will apply. So I just drag it there, and it works. And that's what you get. That looks good. Now we're going to animate this. You go to rotation here, and uh, click on rotation, and then just give the change the give a keyframe here on the rotation. Y type here 10 and then your timeline have to be on the first uh, on this on the on the zero thingy here and then drag that all the way to the end and then press here 346 type 346 and then play it And then that's what you get. Okay, if you liked my video, just uh, make a comment, give a rate, and please check my website, which is www.
www.botworld.org and give me some feedbacks that site I've built new and uh, I will appreciate your bad or good feedbacks uh, your feedbacks are welcome thank you for watching and see you on the next video